Welcome back. You're still watching Waze. National Waffle Day is celebrated August 24th in the United States. It commemorates the anniversary of the patenting of the first waffle iron in the U United States by Cornelius Swart Swartout of Troy, New York. On the 24th, 1869, the first waffle was made in Belgium in the 13th century. They were made by pouring batter into mold with a gilded pattern on the bottom. The waffles were cooked over a fire. Over time, the waffles spread out into other parts of Europe and eventually to the United States. Waffle Day. Happy Waffle Day. Happy National Waffle Day. Happy National Waffle Day. I think we, the person that created waffle is actually a genius. Sha Why? They should, stop. they should stop all those Akara waffles. I know those that one waffles. is Nigerian that are just trying to be extra. Vanilla waffle. <laughs> I, I don't understand it when I start to see pink waffle, green waffle. I don't understand. The latest one I saw is Akara waffle. I'm like, I saw it this is like, creativity hey. if you ask me. Well, maybe for children because you it's need to creativity. make their food. Yeah, you look know, very for children, enticing. for some of yeah. them, it has to look good to mm -hmm. taste good. Yeah, if it doesn't look good, they're they not eating it. it. But I love yeah, waffles that. in ice cream, eating it like that with um, um whipped cream. I don't know. And, and to believe well. that waffles started, I think, you know, some of these things in for us in Nigeria, waffle mm. started with like toast. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. how. That's <laughs> what we used to think was waffles, yeah. Yeah. like yeah. toast, toast bread. They now put honey on it, or you put butter on it, and you put something, and then you cut it up. And <laughs> but well, now is Waffles Day, and I wish all of you happy, happy waffles. National <laughs> Waffles Day. Have a waffle today. At least I was the next. <laughs> oh guys, my goodness. What did you find in the news? Okay. Hmm. My guy, yes, so wiki, is about to give them hot hot in a city. I love it actually. <laughs> when I saw he was <laughs> for it. Was I'm like, this guy is about to bring in some serious discipline into the city. Because the truth is the the city is slowly becoming like Lagos. Yeah. Again, you know, all that nonsense manaris must be people driving anyhow you know they have these very wide roads and then you just see people doing all sorts you know and this sure. is there now to bring the sanity back unfortunately i don't live in abuja maybe this is it this is the time to move to this so this is him what um, so he there was a collapsed building yeah. um i think uh yesterday and <laughs> he said now he has ordered the arrest of the landlord of the building um let me just um take the story very quickly and this was by um, daily post and it was said that the minister of the federal capital territory has ordered the arrest of landlord, landlord of the collapsed two-story building he reports daily re, daily post also reported that um the fc police announced on thursday in a statement that there were two people that died while 20 others have been evacuated to the hospitals as the rescue operation continues i mean it's not to stay hearing about collapsed buildings yeah and you know why i love this usually in lagos i'm sorry to say but what we would usually hear is oh we come we commiserate with the families with the family of, of the, the lost disease. lives yeah. and blah 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 blah. But this is a man of action, in as much as we all say hey, some is this is that. He has now said that this man, the owner of this building, will be brought to brought to law because there are certain approvals that this person probably did not get. Yeah. Meaning that so some investigation will be done will be at least to find out, out. Yes. because a lot of people over time and they you know they avoid all this supposed mm -hmm. guidelines mm -hmm. that help them to make sure like the building and the construction is done yeah, properly. properly yeah yeah so that's it wow dami okay so what i found in the news was um so ketensha said stop putting young lives at risk Call, i mean she called for this crap of nyc i don't know i think that i look here agree <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Maybe in this recent time and age, I'm not particularly sure the purpose of NYC anymore. I feel like it has lost its um, its um, initial purpose. Value. Yeah, because the the I know that one of the reasons why NYC was encouraged is because we have people come from different parts of Nigeria. You know, some people that have even gone to study abroad. You know, they come back to the country, mix up with different people, and like. We're having this conversation backstage, and my dear sister, yes, 
she said, you know how NYC has impacted life, people's no, my life. life once in one of NYC. Honestly, I met the person that helped to literally change the trajectory of my life during my NYS. Well, congratulations. But the you're one, you're one. One out of how many people? Mm. Look, the major reason why she was even calling for this credit. I'm, I'm not <laughs> disputing the fact that NYSC hasn't helped a lot of people. Mm -hmm. It has. You know, for a lot of people who didn't, maybe you either didn't go to boarding mm. house, yeah. so you didn't know how to take care of yourself yeah. and your you know, environment. How to mingle, socialize. You know, how to mingle, so, yeah. Yeah. so there are different things you can pick up. A lot of people, they, they had like pageants and all that in yeah. camp. Then for some other people, it was when maybe they first had their first exercise because you used to have like some people made their raids some people met their you know their spouse you know we have to put that, all that. <laughs> but then <laughs> why? again the main yeah. reason why she you know urged the government to actually scrap this nyc is because of the insecurity mm -hmm. in the country mm -hmm. right now i don't think any parents would love their children to go and willingly serve in the north when they are not going by air True. Going by road is very, it's not okay. so safe right now. In the, that's the major reason why she asked for the scrap of NYSC. On that note, I agree. Because, because I there is kidnapping. If they are not kidnapping, yeah. you are they're they're always in the forefront. Right? I mean, there's, yeah. there's one thing or the other. Yeah. So until Nigeria is safe enough, actually, and can but be will accountable. will we ever be safe enough? Um, hmm. My dear sister, how do I so vote for that, that uh, question that, that's, now? So that's another side of it. Will, we ever, will it ever be safe enough for us to say, okay, let's put back NYSC? So the there was a way forward. It off the table is off the table. Because I don't even see the use at this point. Well, that's you. Some people still see it. Some people think that that's some really. people to some people that's stipend that is given to them. Uh, well, so, yeah, hey, hey, yeah. Yeah. there are different reasons why people I saw steep one tweet to it. Angie, I saw one tweet and girl was like, "You see this old NYSC thing? <laughs> it can be two or three mil max." I don't know why we're doing NYC. It can, it can come in as an email because the entire <laughs> I think it's more about the experience, to be honest. The experience, the experience has been yeah. dented because the truth is, if you go to some NYSC camp, you will not want to be there. So imagine mm, when you're supposed to have an experience same. and then you go there and you, you are have suffering. An experience all the same. Dami. Well, true, Sha. The experience just, can be either good or bad. Nobody ever said you were going to get a uh, five star <laughs> lunch. Like, yeah. 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 We're not even asking Gen for five star. They don't want to <laughs> suffer. We're not even asking for five star, uh, five star lunch or anything, but at least the basics. The kind of What are the basics? Uh -huh. There's no water. Anymore. There's no water. Oh, trust me. There's no water. There in was no water. The bed. <laughs> Sorry, this, I this, said this, in Lagos we have you, water. See, see, I, you can't compare I'm, to I'm not even going to say where I saw it, but <laughs> we also had issues with water. <laughs> but yeah, these things happen. Okay. You know. I rest. I rest. I convert my reason. I agree, Sha, that they should scrap <laughs> NYSC. I, I, I. That one year of our lives. So on that, on that note, I'm indecisive because. I still see some of the good that it brings for certain people. So if you have a generation of, if you have 1,000 people mm. and is able to help 500 people to become better mm. in their lives, whatever area of life, whether social skills, um, personal skills, personal hygiene, what have you, if it helps them, then that's good. Mm. Now, the other side about the insecurity. Now, that insecurity affects every area of our lives it's not just, it's not NYSC. just NYSC. so <laughs> even if they they're not on the nyc you know but now that they say um, nyc people are going to be kidnapping. they are going to be putting them at war fronts so what should we do about that so that i'm going to go around <laughs> I mean, what should we do about that <laughs> okay i'm going to serve my country and they say they want to put me in the war front what should i do well we'll have i'm sure i'm sure we'll have that as a topic one <laughs> Because you I'd see? love to hear about that because I'm wondering how man o war and walking up the hill equates to war new war front. But, no, no, but it's okay. Thank God I have served years ago. Do you get and I would not be nominated Glory for to Jesus. <laughs> so my news is quite, you know, I'm gonna just uh, run to it. So um students of the River State University had to stage a protest over rampant robberies. Robbery attacks in their hostels. They staged a protest because they were a, a few of them were attacked the night before. Um, their valuables were cut out the way, and as well, there were alleged ra uh, rape of some female students. Hmm. So, if we if that video can be put up, you would see um, how much chaos um, this has caused and a lot of you know uncertainty for some of the female students because. 
is and it goes back to what we were just talking about the insecurity and i said it that the insecurity is happening yeah. everywhere it's not just at the nyc camps mm. this is a university i am almost so certain that part of the culprits of this part of the people who will if they are eventually caught you'll find out that they're students they're mm -hmm. your classmates yeah. they're your colleagues they're there they know they hear because that's the thing about social media. When you're on the phone and you're having conversations, oh, Baba is giving me 500,000. A lot of people are listening to that conversation. Sure. That's why you have to always be careful. Yeah. Kind of, of, because that's the thing. Because why would someone... There was even a part of this... Um, this is just the video of the protest. But there was even a part of it... You know, when you look... Because there were several pictures. When you look at some of the pictures, you know, they dug a hole through the wall and everything. These are all informations that... It's, got, it's within the school. Sure. It's not anywhere else. The culprits are within the school system. And it just goes to, it always goes back to tell you or to show you the kind of mindset we have coming up, the younger generation. It's a make, we thought <laughs> make our generation was a make money fast. This one is make, make money, money quick. Swiftly. This one is make money. <laughs> make money now, now. No, no. As in now, now, dot com. That's what it is. <laughs> because you, the, the, when you hear some of the things that they voice mm. and they say, you are just looking at them like, are mm. you? Ha. You are foul. Very, very. Like you're, you're, you're. I don't know if you are, if you can be redeemed mm. with this line of thinking. Mm. And well, anyway, it is well. Thoughts for another day. <laughs> so crazy. we'll go on a short break. See you after the break. <laughs>